People were doing business with one another through the internet already, through bulletin boards, but on the web, we could make it interactive. We could create an auction. We could create a real marketplace. And that's really what triggered my imagination, if you will, and that's what I did. It is not really work if you are having fun. Build a platform. Prepare for the unexpected. You'll know you're successful when the platform you built serves you in unexpected ways. You should pursue your passion. If you're passionate about something and you work hard, then I think you will be successful. We have technology, finally, that for the first time in human history allows people to really maintain rich connections with much larger numbers of people. I've got a passion for solving, a problem that I think I can solve in a new way, and that maybe it helps that nobody has done it before as well. In February of 1996, about six months after I created eBay, I started receiving a spate of complaints. Everyone was complaining about each other. I felt very much like I was a parent who had to adjudicate the brothers beating each other up. If you can get over this initial distrust that people have of strangers, you can do remarkable things. Everyone is born equally capable, but lacks equal opportunity. In 1991, I co-founded my first startup, Inc. Development, which made software for an early tablet computer. Don't let people who you may respect and who you believe know what they're talking about. Don't let them tell you it can't be done because often they will tell you it can't be done and it's just because they don't have the courage to try. We believe that business can be a tool for social good. You'll fail at some things. That's a learning experience that you need so that you can take that on to the next experience. What you learn from those challenges and those failures are what will get you past the next ones. I was the pretty consistent bull 
and the cheerleader on eBay actually. In the same way that you're driven in, your business to keep innovating, Facebook is a wonderful example of constant innovation. Think about doing that in philanthropy. I want people to be entrepreneurs, but I want them to do it for the right reasons. Because they think they can change the world. Because they think they have got something of value to give to the world. Not because they think they can make a lot of money. Long-term sustainable change happens if people discover their own power. eBay's business is based on enabling someone to do business with another person and to do that they first have to develop some measure of trust either in the other person or the system I was just pursuing what I enjoyed doing I mean, I was pursuing my passion. I was raised with the notion that you can do pretty much do anything you want. I always kind of just went ahead and tried things. To truly prepare for the unexpected, you've got to position yourself to keep a couple of options open so when the door of opportunity opens, you're close enough to squeeze through.